Okay, okay, let's get to the root of the tutor right here. This is why Scottie Pippen is really mad. It ain't got nothing to do with Michael Jordan. It ain't got nothing to do with Phil Jackson. The Bulls, none of that. This is why Scottie Pippen been mad. His wife has been partaking in thought activities for the past couple years. Starting with getting around with Future. Now, the disrespect has got even worse. Now, she's out there with Michael Jordan's son. And that's just disrespectful. Like, that's just disrespectful. I'm like, Michael Jordan's son is a, is a, is a that's a little, that's a, that's a shitty thing to do, man. Like, you know that that's your pop's teammate's wife. This, that's a reckless little shit. You know what I mean? That's just, that's just disrespectful. Like, why would you, of all the women in the world, choose this man's wife, ex-wife, that is, knowing the criteria of what's going on with the situation? But there's a lot of things that's going to root, and this is rooted in the Scotty scene. Number one, we can even go back to the Bulls years. Scotty wanted to be the man. He has always felt shafted. He always feels that he's in Jordan's shadow. Even though Michael Jordan has said many times before, without Scotty, I wouldn't have these rings. He, on the other hand, is feeling insecure about that. His insecurity is shown throughout the past several years. And on top of that, we've known how Jordan wasn't the best teammate to be around at times. So you know most likely Michael gave him hell along with he gave Horace hell and all the other teammates hell. Like Michael was just an asshole to a lot of his teammates. And Scotty felt a sort of way about it. it. And it feels like it chipped off a lot of his manhood. Remember, if y'all look at that clip, there's a clip going around where Charles Oakley had Scotty Pippen, a young Scotty Pippen, yoked up in like a classroom. And it just made Scotty don't feel like a man. I think Jordan really chomped him down in a lot of those practices and a lot of those games. Because you even saw the resentment in the 98 season where he didn't even want to play with the Bulls. But at the same time, he knew that's his only way of winning. Because think about it, y'all. He went to the Rockets. He didn't win. He went to the Blazers. He didn't win. Riding on Michael's coattail was the only way for him to really win. He had his. He knew he had his best shot in 93-94 when Michael retired because they were still running on fumes from that championship season. But when they lost Horace Grant, that was it. And they struggled. So they had to get Mike back. But being that he's always labeled as Robin the Michaels Batman, then this situation with his wife getting around, that really took a blow on Pippen's ego. And it's one thing for it to be a teammate. It's one day if she slept with a nigga like Brian Shaw. But when she's sleeping with these rappers, these entertainers, these young dudes, it messed with Pippen's soul. They had to hurt Scotty. So, he's taking a lot of that anger out on his teammates. He's taking the anger out on Michael. He's taking his anger out on Phil. He's taking his, his real anger, with, as they would say, with that bitch. That's what's really causing all that. He ain't, but he ain't really put that out there like that. That's really the root of it. That's really the root of, of Scotty's troubles. He probably felt a sort of way, but you've never seen him throwing shade at Mike like he's doing now. One, first it was, oh, LeBron's a better player. Now, Michael was a horrible player. Now, you just, you just all, all, all together dismissing Michael's whole game. But in reality, a part of that, is you salty. You knew 
You knew you needed Mike to win those chips. That's why when Mike, you were begging Mike to come back at the 95 and then 1995, you was begging him to come back then. But it's two, it's, it's this, those main things. Number one, mainly that bitch. She's the one that got him feeling the sort of way. Then on top of that, he's having flashbacks of times where he probably was chewed out by Michael. Shoot, <laughs> but Michael wasn't the best teammate at times. So he's probably having flashbacks of that, and people always refer to him as Robin. You had a chance to be Batman. You had the bet the best chance you had to be Batman was 93-94, man, and he and he and he dropped the ball. So be happy you got that legacy. Be happy you in the Hall of Fame. Be happy that you got those rings and those accolades. Without he even Michael even said out of his mouth, without Scotty, I would not be who I am. So take that for what it is, man. You really insecure about your lady. That's what it's really all about. So, this is the root of Scottie Pippen's issues. It ain't with Michael Jordan. It ain't with the Bulls. It ain't with Phil Jackson. It's this. And Jordan's son piping his wife down made him feel a sort of way. So, that's what it is. So, enjoy y'all Memorial Day. This is King Eric signing off. Subscribe at the like button. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Peace.